This game is the Bills Super Bowl, right? They've been waiting for this game for years now to host the Kansas City Chiefs uh, in their place. They're, they're, they're a two seed. They're looked upon as a favorite to get to the Super Bowl. We know what their power ranking is. Sammy's talked about it for weeks now, despite their record of how good their team actually is. Now, the injuries to bear are a real concern. They have no linebackers and no secondary players left. But can the Chiefs catch the football, right? I mean, that's been a problem for them all season long, no matter who they play. I thought offensively, though, against the Dolphins, they looked really good. They just continue to have those errors, right? The block in the back, uh, you know, a drop pass, the sort of derailed drives. You can't do that. In, in Buffalo, but I think Tra uh, Travis Kelsey over receptions and I think Isaac Pacheco over rushing yards to me are, are plays to make a Kansas City because of the linebacker issues in Buffalo. The last time the Chiefs played in Buffalo, it's, it was 2000, uh, excuse me, uh, 2020. So it wasn't recent per se, but they ran the ball for 265 yards. Like they went in there and said, we're going to run the football and take the crowd out of it. And I feel like in this game, they're going to do that exactly. Let, let's run the football, establish the line of scrimmage, and just take it to Buffalo. So that's why I like those wagers. I don't think we see Kelsey drop three passes again, but uh, this game will be a lot of fun, man. And the pressure's all in Buffalo in this spot where they haven't been this, you know, kind of had this pressure in a long time. To me, it's an under game. I, I think we've talked about it all year. I wish I bet it accordingly more because the Chiefs has just been a, uh, an ATM if you just bet their unders. There's this perception that it's Mahomes, it's Allen. I think a lot of people think, oh, it's going to be you know, 31-28 back and forth. That overtime game two years ago, which was the same round, same time slot it, it, two years ago. It's a little deja vu for the Bills. That was 42-36. These are not th those type of teams anymore. The Bills run the ball a lot. The Chiefs don't have a lot of weapons, but they're better on defense. To me, this is more like a 23-20 type of game. Uh, I, I don't love the side either. I would lean towards the chief just because it's Mahomes. I'm getting points. Bills are beat up. Plus you get extra rest with the chief chief play on Saturday. Bills had to play Monday late afternoon. And remember the chiefs basically had a bye week 18. They got to sit all of their important players. So should be a fun game. Uh, mentioning the game two years ago reminded me of something. I wish I brought this up last week. There are new overtime rules. So just keep that in mind for live betting. Uh, once you go to overtime, if you score a touchdown first, the other team gets a chance to match. So maybe you play defense defense first. Maybe if you do give up the touchdown, you go for two. So plus one, plus two and a half, plus one and a half. Those numbers are more valuable because a game could land on one. Just keep that in mind. Would be a little bit ironic if, you know, that this was the reason they changed the overtime rules was Chiefs Bills a couple years ago, pretty much. It would be ironic if this goes to overtime again, which is not impossible. I think I saw 11, 12 to one uh, for this game to go to overtime. So, so keep that in mind with the rules for live betting, all, all those types of things. Uh, a derivative. I like Mahomes. I didn't see the number, but I'm sure his over rushing yards is something I'll play. He just goes back to pass. He has nobody open. His only option is to run. So should be a fun game. This is really, this is the best rivalry in the NFL. I mean, it was Seahawks 49ers for a bit. It was Steelers Ravens for a while. It was Manning versus Brady. We don't really have that one now. This is it. Mahomes Allen. This should be a lot of fun. If the bills can't get him this year with th this version of the chiefs in Buffalo, you start to wonder if you're ever going to beat them. Not only have five of the last six chief games gone under Kansas city is the best under team in the NFL this season. Crazy to think that, yes. given the Mahomes and Kelsey and Reed, this this team is winning with defense. I made the total 40. It's 45 and a half, so I tend to agree with Will there. And, and look, I have to bring this part up because nobody else is going to bring it up. We all have our Bills futures for the most part. I've got Bills AFC Super Bowl. Will had it a week before. He bet it before the uh, Kansas City game. Is there a world? I don't have a tinfoil hat, but is there a world where the NFL – has more to gain by the Chiefs going back to the Super Bowl. Can we all have, I mean, the Swifties, uh, the I ratings, no? no? Uh oh. Can you no? dude, a, 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 like, a, like a Buffalo, dude, Sammy, a Buffalo Detroit Super Bowl would do wonders for the National Football League. Like, no, I, I, more like, than Mahomes the, and the Kelsey? Been there before. If you're taking Buffalo, the Taylor Buffalo. Swift in, this, in consideration, maybe because of that, but like, from a from a from a storyline perspective and fans showing up to Vegas and the numbers I think a Buffalo Detroit would do. Kansas is not a major market. People tune in because of Mahomes. I guess if Taylor Swift is going to be there, people watch anyways. I don't think they're going to rig the game for the for the Chiefs, man. I, I, Buffalo right. their story we went over would this. do better in my opinion than Kansas City being back. We went over this earlier in the year. She's going to be in Japan. She's got shows in Japan yeah. for Super Bowl weekend. So it's not. Oh, you're right. Yeah, she does. Yeah. Not even yeah. going to be there. You, you call yourself Swifties? I'm the one looking at the concert schedule back in October when we brought this up. I mean, maybe she could like fly there and back her, but 
It might, might, it might be tough. I'm trying to shoot some holes in your conspiracy theory there, Sammy. I didn't say they would rig the game either. I'm just saying, like, it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world if Kansas City got back to the Super Bowl. And let's also not act like sure. Taylor Swift well, cares about the environment. She's been flying all over the world. <laughs> Bear Bets full episodes drop twice a week right here on the Bear Bets YouTube channel. Remember to subscribe to stay ahead of the odds and let's celebrate all of our wins together.